Welcome back, YouTube, to another video. This is part two of Feeling Empowered Upon Waking Up. Excellent. I don't know what I'm going to... I think I'm going to call it that. I forgot to mention uh, something. Okay, last night I was doing another act, act of trance as I usually do, and I was... Looking straight up to the heavens, uh, my eyes were heavenward, and I, I said a sentence, and right after that, my crown chakra was stirring. It woke up, and then, ever since then, I've just been feeling more empowered. So, I went from... Earlier that day, I was feeling off because I felt uh, that light arrow hit me. After the video, I you was feeling... Okay, let me start from the beginning. Okay, you have an event one. Light arrow shoots into the heart chakra center. Destroying evil that could remain that I was not aware of. Event 2. Feeling off, but not totally. Event 3. Made the video, said I was off, but after the video, I was starting to feel more empowered. Event 4. I was doing my active trance, and... As usual, only to this time, I was, my eyes were looking upward, heavenward, to the heavens above, speaking directly to the universe. I was looking up, my eyes were literally looking up, and I said something. And then, after I said that, I noticed my crown chakra was tingling. It was awakening, activating. And then I I was trying to fall asleep only to discover that, okay, my body's too charged. I have too much energy that I pulled into my body. Again, common theme as of late. Uh, only two nights in a row. Maybe three. Okay. Next event, I wake up. Okay, but n no, not, yeah. Next event, I think it carried over into my dreams because I was still feeling empowered. Then I wake up and I felt even more powerful than when I felt from last night. And then I made the the previous video, part one of this video, and then I forgot to explain that crown chakra feeling of fun last night. Even now, I can feel my wings veil and just feeling really empowered, glowing white. Like, I am com coming out of whatever I was filming from two weeks ago to... Okay, you know what? I'm going to be more empowered. I came back to my senses. I woke back up. I climbed out of the hole I found myself in. I pushed forward through the trauma. I left social media, there's really no point in continuing that when it was not helping my YouTube and in the process, I was upset that I was not getting any uh, note. I was invisible. I was having zero interactions with people. Every now and then, I would, but ultimately, I wanted a thousand friends or whatever I wanted on Facebook. And yeah, not a good thing to have floating in your mind. 
I loved Facebook. I loved social media, not just because of the trauma, just because I figured out what, why Facebook is bad for me, and created the Discord. Subconsciously, I was continuing my work as a light worker. Consciously, I wanted nothing to do with it. However, my soul somehow pushed forward. The lesson is, when you get knocked down, what do you do? You climb back up. Even if you're not aware of it, subconsciously, I did climb back up. I arose. Even though, consciously, I was at rock bottom. How I climbed back up, I have no idea how, because consciously, what I was seeing was a completely different story than what my higher self was seeing or my subconscious. So that was ending a comment, ending part two of the video. Until we meet again, hopefully to see you in the Discord server. Until we meet again, my light being friends. <laughs> Still trying to figure out how to do that, even so I well. But yeah, go and do call the tail.